<coughs> hey guys, what's up? This is Katie from Limited Dollars bringing you a comic book haul. I'm actually recording this on my iPhone, so sorry if it's a little shaky. Um, hey everybody, Happy New Year's. Uh, oh, 2017. Woo! Um, hope you guys had a safe, fun New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. Um, I went to my local, actually it's not, it's kind of local, um, it's a store that has books and CDs and, uh, comics. And she has a box of comics. Like, there's three boxes, three short boxes filled with comics for one dollar. And I was sitting in my house and I'm like, hey, why don't I just go buy some comics? So I went there and I picked out a, I had a... 15 or 16 but then I kind of windowed it down to like 10 because I bought a CD so I'll show you these 10 comics right now so first up we have a uh, Batman detective comics number 623 and for being in a dollar bin for who knows how long not in bad condition and it's got a joker that's what really um drew me to this uh, comic was just a joker right there. Anyway, paid a dollar. Not too bad. Next up, I have uh, X-Men Classics. And um, this one I really liked because it was just a really bright red. And I know that X-Men Classics um, are like reprints of old stories from like the, the silver... Bronze, it's, I don't know what it is. But yeah, just old reprints of good stories. And this one is um, 59. It's got Wolverine fighting some like crazy bug thing. And that price right there, I mean that line right there even, it's just on the bag. It's not on the comic. I checked that. Anyway, moving on. Next up, we have another bright red comic with a, uh, what, Black Widow? And the Punisher. <clears throat> Punisher War Journal number 9. I just I really like this cover. As I said before, it's really red. And the condition isn't that bad. So I'm pretty stoked about that. Dream time with the Black Widow. Word. Next up, we have a Magneto. I just thought this was a really cool... This is... I don't know. I just like this cover a lot. Um, at first, I'm like kind of confused of who that was. I thought it was like his son, Quicksilver. But then I know it might not be. I have no idea. But like it just looks really... Like the cover is amazing. And back in the day, it was $2.75 Canadia. And I paid a dollar. Okay, this one... Wolverine and Gambit. I have one of these already, and this one is October's all-new X-Men special event. I think Gambit is a really cool character. I I just like his um the way he talks and the, him throwing the cards and them blowing up like right there. And Wolverine's like freak. He's bad. B A. He's a B A. Just with his claws. I don't know. It's a really sick book. I haven't read it yet, but I will. Next up, we have Wolverine Soul Taker, num number two of five. Um, as I said before, this is just on the bag, not the book. I mean, wow. He is just looking for... I didn't even know what. But, uh... I don't know, the cover... Is really cool. I'm actually excited for that uh, new Wo Logan movie that's coming out. I think in May, May or March, April. I don't know when it, next this year sometime. I I don't know. It's gonna be freaking sweet. Um, Wo Wolverine has always been one of my favorite characters. I um always look out for his books when I'm comic book hunting. All right, so then we have. Wolverine Soul Taker, 3 of 5. I actually didn't see part 1. 
but I think there was part four, so I might go back and get that. And here he is fighting like some samurai from who knows. And Wolverine's just, wow. That's a really cool cover. Um, then we got this one. I thought I was, I wasn't going to get this one. I kept this debating on it being like, well, should I get it? Should I not get it? And then I'm just like, I've never seen this before. I want to pick it up. It's uh, number 11, and it's called Spider-Man's Tangled Web Open All Night. It's got the Vulture. It's got J.J. John, James, whatever his name is. Spider-Man, Peter Parker. I don't know. I just think this cover is super sweet. And uh, there was a couple times I'm like, do I need this comic? Do I want this comic? But in the end, I decided, hey, you know what? I'll pick it up. Then we got Ghost Rider number 35. And, I don't know, this cover, like, look at it. He's got, like, a, <clears throat> a laser beam coming out of his, or shooting through his chest. So it says Ghost Rider versus Heart Attack. And, wow. I mean, I wonder what's going to happen in this book. <clears throat> I mean, condition-wise... The black is really, it's not breaking out or anything. There's no, like, color breaks. And the spine's really nice. Alright, last up, we got another classic X-Men. This one's number 15, Nightmare Crystal. And what's happening with Nightcrawler? And there's Colossus. Whoa, look at his face. And Storm's face. Look at Wolverine's face. Ah, whoa, that that looks. It must. That's awesome. Ooh, I never really noticed that. I just grabbed a classic action. I didn't really look at the faces, but the faces. Jeez. Wow. Anyway, that was the last uh, book I had. And if I had to pick a favorite book cover, like a top cover top pick i'd probably have to say the first one with batman the batman detectives comic with the joker i just think this cover this cover i'd say is like a out of one to ten is like a like a, a good solid eight with the joker i don't know i just like this color cover you guys leave in the comments of what your favorite color cover is and yeah that's that's sweet um anyway I paid $10 for this lot. Not too bad. Nothing spectacular. Nothing worth more than a dollar, probably. I don't even know. But uh, I'm going to be start doing more videos. I keep saying that, but this time I mean it. Like, comment, and subscribe. Check out my other comic haul videos. I have gotten a few um, kind of solid hauls. Um, yeah, there's, I think I have, like, what, 14 of them? 14 comic calls? Yeah. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe, and see you in the next video. Peace.